The X-H1 has a 24 megapixel APS-C sensor with the X-Trans CMOS 3 processor that handles noise just as well as a full frame sensor, in my opinion. Now for videography, the X-H1 takes the cake if you're looking for an easy to use system equipped with a log profile. Now the X-H1 also has the Eternal profile, which I hardly ever use, but I will be using it soon to learn how to expose and grade that profile. I equate the X-H1's Eternal profile and log profile to the Sony a7 III with the S-Log2 profile and if it had s -Cine tone. Now when you are actually shooting, I find that you get the best experience when you are behind the camera, when you are the camera operator. You can vlog with the X-H1, but I find it to be anxiety provoking when in front of the camera because you can't see the screen. But after a while, you kind of get used to not being able to see the screen. It's just tricky when exposing the shot.